Welcome to this Team Center Visualization Product Overview. Team Center Visualization is available in four levels. Visualization Base gives the ability to fully work with 2D data as well as basic 3D viewing. Visualization Standard adds to Base with 3D markup, measurement and the ability to view PMI data. Visualization Professional adds functions such as sections and 3D comparison. Visualization Mockup adds static and dynamic clearance analysis. Team Center Visualization supports a number of industry CAD and image formats, in addition to the JT format. As an example, I'm showing here opening a variety of formats. DWG, IGES, and a JT file with attached FEA data. An NX 3D CAD file is opened directly. In the project workspace on the left of the screen, the assembly structure is displayed. It can be expanded or collapsed depending on the levels to be shown. Components can be selected directly from the graphics window or the project workspace. Once the component is selected, commands can be issued to impact the display of the component. Fly to part centers and zooms the component. View only turns off the display of all other components. Going up the assembly tree, I can select surrounding components. Turn off turns off individual components. Selecting a component multiple times takes you up the assembly tree. Each selection is up one level. Selected only shows only those objects selected. Standard views can be selected and displayed with or without a reference grid. Attributes of stored with the CAD data can be viewed directly. Three D markup can display data as notes for each component. Three D measurement displays information on size and distance. Snapshots store the condition of the model, including viewing angle and what is visible. Once captured, they can be retrieved for later use. Three D markup allows the user to annotate the object in three D and two D space.
components can be viewed in 3D sections. The sections can be stored and marked up as 2D or 3D images. A matrix clearance analysis can be run on groups of components. Here it is run on all visible components. The clearance analysis results are displayed in a new window. Each violation can be reanalyzed and viewed. Differences between parts and assemblies can also be reviewed. By selecting two part sets, the review can be undertaken. The parts can be visually compared. A tricolour analysis shows the differences between the two parts. The blue are the common faces and the green are the faces in the second part that have changed.